Well, I'm back, and I'm sitting here with probably one of the most working actors in Hollywood. Oh, I actually knew this Lord. guy long before V. Would you please say hello and welcome Frank Ashmore? Frank, how you doing? I'm good, Nikki. Hello, I am buddy. tickled to see you, man. This has been a long you. time. Uh, Frank, uh, as you know, I'm playing that uh, turncoat lizard. No! I had a hard time with that, man, because, you know, Ironside and I both, Ham and Chris, we didn't like a lizard. I don't care whose side he was on. We just wanted to kill a lizard. There's we thought no you'd lizard. make good luggage. That's right. That's right. So that's now... That's what I was to you. Every time I looked in your eyes, I saw a suitcase. That's right. You would make good luggage. Tell me, when you first got this job, uh -huh. tell me a little bit about your feelings and, and your on the story, on the script, on the whole concept of the show. Well, when I first read the script, I, I knew that it was something special, something that I wanted to be a part of. And when Ken asked me to do it, it was like, you know... No, no, no problem whatsoever, uh, especially with a character he was asking me to do, Martin. You know, it was a unique character, and, and you were in the minority as far as being exactly. uh, uh, against the lizards and being a lizard. So it's a, it's a tough, tough tightrope to walk, and you did a great job, man. Well, that's what I loved about the character. Um, he was uh, impelled to uh, help the humans, and uh, he was um, working with a lot of fear. Which well, was a nice quality for an actor to play. Absolutely. And a lizard, they didn't have emotion or a heart or they didn't care. But there was a little select group, you and Bobby England, that yeah. really did care. Yeah. So it, it was a great quality to be able to play as an actor. It was, was, a, it lot was a lot of fun. Color there. And it's funny, uh, Michael Ironside and I, as Ham and Chris, mm -hmm. uh, playing these uh, mercenaries who came in and really wanted to take over the resistance and we... we all we wanted to do was kill a lizard. That's right. And it didn't matter if you were on our side or That's not. Right. And I can remember scenes out at, uh, we were out at the lighthouse. That's out right. at, Was that Point Dune? Or, yeah, that's right. And uh, you guys uh, drove up in the truck. we drove up in the truck and your spacecraft landed. And even though you were my friend in the scene, I looked at <laughs> you like, let's just, let's just slip this guy right now. Yeah, so uh, there was some good acting going on there, Mickey. Well, there was a lot. Even you and I had a little piece uh, yeah. toward each other yeah. that... Uh, uh, now, what's been on the agenda for Frank Ashmore lately? A lot of theater, a uh, couple of episodes of The Practice, uh, an episode of um, Touched by an Angel with Michael Jeter, which was real sweet. To do. Michael Jeter and I did a film called Drop Zone, one of the nicest guys, oh, one of the best he, actors you'll ever meet. And it's funny that, that you're doing theater, and that's where we first met in yeah. community theater yeah. long before V. Right. So uh, you, you like being on stage. I do. I love stage. That's where I... Um, where I learned to craft, and um, you know, it, it's nice to go back. Uh, I would certainly welcome more TV work. All, work. all of us would. But um, the theater is it for me. I, I love it. I just love that experience. You know, I, it, when I first became an actor, I didn't have a big desire to do theater. And then I did a play. I did a play for two years called Daddy's Dying, Who's Got the Will, right. and I fell in love with the, oh, yeah. with the theater. So uh, until you do it, yeah, I don't think uh, people appreciate no. it. Well, now, uh, everything's okay with the family, and, and, every, and you're feeling good? Oh, I'm feeling great. My daughter's 16 years old. She was born during the first four-hour miniseries. I have a picture of Jane Badler and Jenny Sullivan holding Jillian oh, that's great. on the set at Warner Brothers. And she's 16, and she's starting a music career. Oh, that's great. Um, uh, you know, that. we, we should probably not just meet at a convention. We should probably try to get together and see each other more. We do. We need to. It's awful good to see you, brother. Thank you for you, coming. Brother. All right. Any last little comment to all the fans that are out there? I just want to thank everybody for being here today. Uh, it was so special to be able to meet a lot of you and thank a lot of you for the support that you've shown V over the years. And, you know, it was a two-way street. You got to meet us, and we got to meet you. It, is fun, it, for being here. it is fun to go one-on-one. -on -one. Absolutely. Right. Thank you so much. God Great bless you, brother. You. All right, buddy. Thanks for doing that. Well, I'm sorry.